Hello and welcome. My name is April Ray, CEO and founder of the Introvert Mogul Studios. Welcome to iMogul TV, where I like to talk about a little bit of beauty, a little bit of branding, a little bit of business, because that's what I love to do. So really quick, I want to share with you a conversation that I had. Um, someone was inquiring about how can they stand out from all of the other people who are in business doing the same thing that they're doing or selling the same product that they're selling. This person isn't in, um, a I don't believe she's in a network marketing or a direct selling business, but because it applies basically to anyone in business. And she wanted to know how can she stand out? And really the, the answer is in your branding. Okay, so think about Target and Walmart. Now, Target and Walmart sell pretty much the exact same things, pretty much, um, but they both have a different brand that stands out and attracts certain people. Walmart talks about the low cost and Target talks about they're kind of a fun, they have a fun sort of, you know, if you've seen their commercials uh, recently or in the last couple of years, it's fun, it's young, it's youthful, it's hip, and um, it's a little bit higher priced than Walmart. So selling their, they're selling the, the exact same or similar products, but they're both successful businesses and their brand is what is attracting the people to them. Some people are attracted to Target, some people are attracted more to Walmart. So it's the same thing in business. Now, if you're in network marketing or in direct sales, I always say you must brand you. You have to. You can't brand your business because you can't rely on that company, that MLL company. They may not be around and everybody, like I said, everybody's selling it. So how do you stand out? You brand yourself. You start with um, what makes you different from the other guy. It's your personality. It's who you are. So I always tell people you got to incorporate your personality as much as possible. What kind of things do you love about not just your business, but just in general? Right? I love old movies. I love old Hollywood. I'm a big fan of old Hollywood. If you go to my website, you'll see remnants of old Hollywood and the, specifically the old Hollywood studios from back in the day because I think they were really good at branding their actors. Um, and you'll see that in my blog. You'll see that on my website. That, But I sell, I basically market branding and, and digital marketing. I help people with ads and social media and the like. And there's a lot of other people doing that exact same thing. But I don't have to worry about that because I'm attracting the people because of the kind of brand that I've created. You want to create, obviously, it's going to be your logo. It's going to be the color choices that you choose. And it's going to be the niche that you're in as well as who you want to attract. Who do you want to be your ideal client? Who is your ideal customer? Who's your ideal prospect? Those are the people you want to speak to. And those are the people, the kind of people that you want to brand for to some degree. It's a 50-50. It's you're branding you so that you can stand out from the other person. You're positioning yourself from the other person. And you're also branding so that you're attracting people to you, people that kind of like what you like. Maybe you're quirky, so you attract quirky people. You want to put as much of your personality as you can into your brand so that's the main thing that or the main advice now branding can take time because you got to do market research especially if you're not in network marketing or MLM you want to do a lot of market research you want to find out what other people who are selling similar products or maybe services that you provide offline or whatever you want to find out what they're doing and so you got to do that research with your network marketing businesses, you want to do research as well, but you basically get to start, you get to create your own thing. You know, you, you already know what your product is. Um, you all pretty much already have a niche, but you can niche down. And that's a whole nother topic where you can make it more strategic. But that's pretty much it I wanted to share. Um, that's, if you want to stand out online, if you want to stand out in your business, you got a brand. And my lights keep flickering like they're going to go off. And I'm going to be pretty upset if they do in the middle of my video. <laughs> All right. So that's it. If you enjoyed this video, leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe. All right. Thank you for joining me and bye-bye for now.